addition of integers integers addition involves adding either two positive integers or two negative integers and one positive integer with one negative integer we look into all three different scenarios adding two positive integers is same as adding two whole numbers consider any two numbers like 36 and 12 to add these two things we'll just add values from each place and the answer is 48 so in this process there is no change now to add the two negative integers here we have to add minus 24 and negative 56 these are two negative integers for that while adding as both are negative we will directly add the values and keep the negative sign before it so this will give the result we just have to add the numerical values and keep the negative sign before the resultant value while adding one positive integer and one negative integer say add negative 36 and 21 here this is negative and this is positive for this now without considering the sign take the greatest number 36 in this case and then the smaller one 21 do the subtraction of this 15 consider the sign of the minuend here minuend here is 36 and for 36 we have negative sign before that so we'll keep negative 15 as answer for this one let us look into another example say we have to add negative 32 and 45 as both are of different signs, first consider the greatest numerical value. In this case, it is 45. And the remaining one is 32. Perform subtraction on this. We subtract these two things. The value is 13. For this, the sign would be that of the minuend. Here, 45 is the minuend. And the actual 45 has got positive sign when we are not mentioning anything before a numerical value it means it's a positive one so the answer is 13 itself this is how we have to add positive integer and negative integer we have to perform the subtraction and give the sign of whichever is greater among the two subtraction of integers the way we have three different cases in addition even in subtraction, we'll have all the three different ways. The first one is to subtract two positive integers, which is same as subtracting two whole numbers. 36 and 12 are two positive integers. And while subtracting them, we'll do the normal process and write down the answer. Now, while subtracting two negative integers, consider two negative integers we are subtracting them the first one is negative 24 and then we have negative 56 to write this how we can write negative 24 minus of minus 56 here we know of is nothing but multiplication and we also have the rules like positive into positive is always positive. Negative into negative is positive. Positive into negative is negative. Negative into positive is negative. So when we have two similar signs getting multiplied, then we'll have positive as answer. And if we have two different signs getting multiplied, we have negative. So here negative of negative. Here negative of negative means it is positive. So this will get converted as negative 24 plus 
56. This operation is nothing but adding one positive and one negative wherein we have to subtract those two numerical values and then give the sign of the highest numerical value among those two. So it is 56 minus 24 that is 32 and the greatest among these two is 56 the sign for which is positive so 32 is the answer negative 24 minus of negative 56 will give 32. Let us understand this with another example. So we are trying to subtract negative 45 and negative 32. So as an expression we will write it as negative 45 minus of negative 32 which is nothing but negative 45 will remain as it is negative sign here this one into negative negative into negative two both are same so it becomes plus 32 one negative value and one positive value while doing this we have to subtract one from another that is 45 minus 32 which is 13 and for this we will give the sign of the minuend here or the greater among the two which one is greater among the two here it is 45 so 45 has got negative sign before it so we'll give negative for this the resultant is negative 13 is the answer here now, when we have to subtract one positive integer from one negative integer or negative from positive, both the ways we will look into with help of some examples. Consider the first one is to subtract negative 36 and 21. A negative integer and a positive integer. So, how we have to write it? negative 36 minus of 21 so minus here this is a minus and here without any sign it means it's a positive in previous one we have already looked into this that when we have two different signs the resultant would be negative so this can be rewritten as negative 36 minus 21 so both have got negative signs before the numerical values where we have to add and just keep the negative sign. So we'll add 36 and 21 that is 57 and before that we will write down this negative sign. Now let us look into another example say we have to do subtraction of 45 and negative 32. So here again what we have a positive and a negative. We can rewrite this as 45 minus of minus 32. Again we have a negative here and another negative here. So negative into negative both are same which will give us a positive sign. So 45 plus 32. Both are positive values now after this conversion so we can directly write down 77 as the answer. This is how we have to do addition or subtraction on integers and we have to be careful with the way we are going to write down as an expression while performing the subtraction or addition and also remember that Multiplying two similar things will give you a positive sign whereas if we have to multiply a positive and negative then the resultant will have the negative sign for it.